This is where it all happens. Every year, hole 17, hay bales. You know the rules of the hole. If you're one of those weirdos that doesn't want to know who wins, turn it off because things are about to get very real. Throw your computer, throw your cell phone device in the trash. Take the battery out, dispose of that responsibly, and throw the rest away because your computer already knows who won. Chris, short... Got to get a Short. skip. Got to get a skip. Oh, my gosh. All that hyzer on the putter, it just oh, isn't going to reach it. And he has to rethrow, regroup, calm the nerves. This shot is huge. This is also low. It's moving Come fast. On. Can that skip? No. And this is oh. a nightmare for Chris. Now he's got a driver. A little more speed. A little wider. This has got to slow down now, though. Oh, no. This is just in long the drink and circle two, circle three range. And this is for seven for Chris. And James Conrad's lead. Thank you. Mm. And this putt for eight. And, and worth noting, Chris Clemens. Look at the composure. Lead and ended, and it ended up costing him the tournament. So we'll have to see what Johnny McRae can do. He's going to take a putter. He's going to go right for it with a four-stroke lead. Yeah, that one uh, that one went a little long, um, and he really rushed into this second shot a little quicker than most of us expected. Um, and it just dropped out of the sky. Just a little short. You could hear him begging for it just to be long enough. And this is this is tough right here. He's, he's figuring out what to do. How do, how do you settle down and just execute in a moment like that it's tough um i don't know if i'd be able to handle it as well as johnny did here uh he had that one drop out again and i don't know what i would do honestly but you know <laughs> you got johnny who a man of great faith just offers it up and says all right it's gonna happen it's gonna happen he puts a little more on this one the air's underneath it. It looks like it's sliding out. Spotter runs over. And a green flag, finally. T-pad, and I was just listening to the crowd this whole time. Tough heartbreaker. He leaves it a little high. Johnny McRae. Looked good. Looked good from our angle. Just a little. Commit a little bit more and put a little bit more speed on their disc. I believe it's playing a bit into a cross headwind today, which makes you have to throw it a little bit harder to get there anyway. And James is going to go with the putter, and this is the most dangerous play on this hole here. Oh, he's caught an early leaf, and that usually means disaster. Sure enough, well short. Uh, Once again, just like Chris Clemens yesterday, your tournament leader coming into this hole, he is not going to be under par on it. This is going to be his third shot here. Bogey at best, unless he can throw it in. Looks like he's turned that one over, and if the wind beats on it like it normally does when you turn it over, it comes up short again. This is a uh, hand on the head, kind of akin to Johnny McRae after he's missed a couple times, hand straight to the head, and not much more you can do here, but just kind of ask yourself, do you want to win this? Let's put it on the green here. This is James Conrad. If he can't get on the island here, he could be in big trouble. Oh, oh by a, less than a foot over top of those bales. It does succeed right side of the island. Don't just try and make it barely over the bales. Get it out into that backside, and he'll have a lot better success rate. And this will be James Conrad for his sixth, I believe. Left it a little wide, expected the wind to maybe lift it and bring it in. And they are a whole bunch of strokes over par as a group, and there is one more grueling hole left to play. Play would be high and then go as far right as possible. Attacking this green, you have to be super confident. And this is going, this looks a little weak, actually. Oh, and it was just barely weak. Yeah, and that's, that's, uh, well, here he goes again. He'll, he'll make the correction. Looks like it. Oh, oh no. And I think that might have been in in last year. That wow. We yeah, the yeah, hay bales is, got This is not good though. Altered. This will add there up so fast. So he has to make that the right had some good height on it. Sexton really needs this. Mm. And the Sexton goes to Nate will also be 3 under. Three under. 
and a par. The chase card is getting even more interesting. James Conrad has thrown three shots out of bounds. He has players on his heels. Oh, that didn't get there either. Wow. There must be a really strong wind pushing to the right there because that thing just fell out of the sky to the right. And again, this low ceiling forces the players to really commit to throwing it at the water. And it also, the protected nature of it means you can't get a good wind read unless you walk out and really feel it. It does tend to swirl and gust in this area. You're down in the valley of the lake and there's hills around you. So you're right, Jim. It's hard to get a read on this hole. Back to 19 under par. And Man. that is, I mean, he was the only player. Well, out of a lead group, you wouldn't think you'd be saying that on a 249-foot hole. Magnolia, rather. Oh, here it is, guys. Here we go. We're going to get to get see Calvin's Ooh. drive before Chris's putt. Man, this is good TV right here. I believe that's a star firebird on Calvin's hands. Yes, it is. Playing for safety. He's hitting Kenny. It's got to get up. It's got to get up. <gasps> oh, no. Just came up a bunch short, in my opinion. If you're trying to play safe, that was a bunch short. This one looks a little better, but yeah, I mean, oh, such a heartbreaker for Vinny. Now he's got to hope that. Oh, you've got to don't no, you dare, no don't you way. dare oh. halfway in the hole. Mm, it it really that thing felt was like halfway in the hole, and oh. he's gonna have to re putt. Oh, he is, isn't he? Look at the guys. All right. Fix that or inside of that just a hair and, you know, just pitch up and take your three and play for par on the last hole and mm. walk out of here a champion. 